Shadow Blockster here from shadowblockster.com and we're here today doing a gear demo you've never seen before. Um, this is my new reverb tank. Actually it's a combination reverb tank, literally a reverb tank, that's right. A combination reverb tank, barbecue pit, and, um, and mobile home, travel trailer. You could call it a scare stream or something like that if you will. But uh, what I really want to talk about is, is summer and the summer environment and how the summer environment is on your strings. That's why we're going to talk about coated strings. Now here I have the Ernie Ball coated slinkies. And um, you know Ernie Ball, they came along with the uh, coated strings a little bit later than everyone. In fact, a lot later than a couple of the other outfits. But uh, they took their time, kind of like uh, when you put a couple of pork butts in here, you take your time and you do it right. And I think they've done a good job. Now, I haven't often been a proponent of the coated strings, but uh, I think in the summer when you're talking about chicken grease and pork fat and mojitos and margaritas and various exchanges of fluids which can spontaneously occur in summer environments, you have to consider your tone, protecting your tone. Um, that starts with protecting your strings and no better way than with a good fine coated string product uh, like the Ernie Balls that we have here that are also fresh, fresh incidentally. Um, so where do you get these kind of strings? Well the best, you know, I mean people say some people don't like coated strings because of the expense and they are more expensive. But a lot of the same people that whine about the expense of coated strings are the same people that have these lost weekends that they come out of the other side of with regrets and, and uh, you know, they're missing a lot of what, what they did and, 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 and they got no money left and, uh, and maybe, maybe they have urgent care fees that they have to pay and, and maybe a DWI or something of that nature. And I think that people that, you know, those people whining about the cost of coated strings, uh, who haven't set their priorities right uh, for how to use their money, I think that those people need to uh, probably represent a different instrument. Um, so, you know, you people that care about your tone, and uh, you care about your strings, and you care about uh, surviving through those harsh summer environments, uh, particularly people who live near the coast, down in the Keys and so forth. Uh, you want to take a look at the coated string products, maybe if only seasonally, uh, but I think they'll treat you right. So listen, uh, I think that's pretty much all we have for you. Uh, take a look at our links, and uh, the best place to buy strings really is the big box stores online. You know, I've got some links. You can choose a few. You can shop around. You can find what you like. Find the best deals. Find the fastest shipping. And go with that. But uh, go with the Ernie Balls because they're fresh. Thank you.